Nibiru, folks. I mean, not Nibiru, Alan, folks. I apologize about that. There is Alan. Alan, the gassy comet Alan, folks, flopping around. Down here on Earth, you can see her. There's the tetrahydrons. Tetrahydrons. I don't care how you say it, they're tetrahydrons. I'm going to show you in a minute. Or actually, I think what we're on to do is we're on to go ahead and we're going to prove the date here. We're going to show the date. We're going to keep this a little bit secret for a little while. Just so everybody knows that we're telling the truth. Okay? There you go. There's the date. And I think even whatever we'll be able to figure out this time. And we'll scoot back and we'll save this video. And we'll zoom out to... There she is, though, folks. And there's tree line, and this is sharing. Just you have the legal rights to sharing it. I quote that at my Bino Blacks dot web dot com. I quote that we have a legal right to share this and educate. We're sharing and educating. And there she is, folks. Tetrahydrons. There's Alanin. I seen the tail tonight up in Western North Dakota, folks. And if you had a clear sky in Montana, you can see it. And there is Nibiru up in the corner, folks. Nibiru will be here sooner or later, and we'll keep seeing it. It's a little bit illuminated right now. But there it is up in the corner. Okay, so there's Nib Nibiru. You're going to be able to see it. Yeah, it'll be behind Common Element. And there is Common Element. Can't be hid, folks. It's the truth. There's tetrahydrons. These tetrahydrons, they follow. Alan, there is common Alan, folks. And there's another tetrahydron down underneath the tree here. I'm going to speed out here to 200%. This is being all black, folks, bringing you the truth as always. There she is, folks. I'm going to try to stay off the mountain so that we can keep on getting the footage for a couple days. And hopefully they'll leave it stay coming around. Maybe it'll never come up in that same area again. You know, maybe we'll get lucky and maybe we will. Okay, folks, so I'm going to blow it up to 400% again. And let you see Alan folks. Common Alan. So we're going to find out if Karasoft keeps on plugging away and not letting you see the truth, folks. Because there is Common Alan. Common Alan, folks, viewed from Earth. A live camera. Okay, that's her, honey. That's it. That's it, folks. It's there, and there is Nibiru glimpsing through outer space from way deep far off. Space weather, folks. No fear here. Space weather. So, backing out. There's the time. And the camera and the name of the mountain. Everything is right up there. I've got it. We've got it, folks. And you've got it here, folks. Bino Blacks. Webs.com. And also, on Bino Blacks' YouTube channel, folks. And Ralph Black's Facebook channel. Okay? The truth, folks. Because I can give you a good upshot close by using the monitor and getting in real close with the camera. And it's a little shaky, but it won't get taken down. Because we own it, folks. The Truth Network. Bino Black's channel on YouTube. Scientifically sharing our finds. And I got a sugar bear friend out there. So she helped us find this. She is awesome. And there is that other tetrahydrin that follows an eye on all the time. You can see it, folks. We're going to keep seeing this stuff, folks. This is an awesome comet. Way more than Halo Bomb. Okay? You can see it in the daytime, folks. Not need in the nighttime. And it's going to get bigger and bigger and bigger, and it ain't even close enough yet. But it's coming. So we're just going to get a nice show, it looks like. Maybe we'll get a little bit of three days of dimness, a little bit of eclipse during the daytime. We'll see. But Alan is coming, folks.
it's real it didn't get bopped down too much in size as you can see it's looking over a mountain range just here yesterday Wednesday September 21st 2011 folks and there's more of the tetrahydrons up a little higher as you can see I'm sure everybody will get a hold of this and try to differentiate look at it talk it down but there is one of the tetrahydrons to the right that we keep on seeing in the footage all the time and there's also a tetrahydron out there in the distance there too I'm trying to zoom in on that but this is real easy to see this tetrahydron here and I was trying to get over here to get this tetrahydron over here on the side as you can see that go back out see if you can see it at all and we'll zoom in to full 100 percent again so there's a 400 percent there's that tetrahydron there's that one in up there and there's the group up there on the side too you can see that and there's Nibiru up again there in 400 percent folks zoom the picture up okay now i'm going to scoot over and see if we can see that tetrahydron anomaly out there and there's also a little bit of an anomaly there it's almost like an x-ray shot of itself in the sky in the glimmer so and then we have that tetrahydron that we talked about on the outside that's always out there but we did grab Nibiru folks up in here that's Nibiru folks you can see from all the other footage you can able to see everybody's trying to squash what the people are seeing in Australia and filming and stuff there she is folks in the daylight yesterday the 21st of September and I'll just move up a little bit and we'll have the the time and the date stamp right there folks government camera we're saving and sharing uh, the government having cameras around helps out for us needing to know a little bit about the truth and there you go there's a group of tetrahydrons just before Nibiru Nibiru is just below the just below the date and time okay we have got Nibiru folks and Alanin and there's more of the tetrahydrons that come across with Alanin like I say personally I've seen the tail tonight I've seen the tail tonight in Western North Dakota this is out east, folks, I believe. All right. So let me scoot over here and see that there's the other tetrahydron to the left, to the right, folks. This is to the right. Pan back to the left. We're panning left. I'm watching the time on the video, folks. It's seven minutes so far. There's the tetrahydron up there. I'm going to zoom up. There she is, Ellen in all of her glory, folks. I hope this comes out good on the video. I'm just angling it, I can kind of see, but she's pretty good that way. And there's the drivers down there, the drivers up here, the drivers in the tree. I'm getting the back out, go to 200%, and there she is, folks, in the mountains, out east. So, I'm not sure if this is in Oklahoma, or if it's out in East Coast range, but we'll know and I'll let you know later. We're just going to keep it a little bit of a secret so that you can keep on checking it out. Oops. We're just kind of zooming in on the tetrahydrons that we showed. That's that big one up here to the right that we keep on seeing in all the shots from space. I think I got tetrahydron there. Yeah, there's tetrahydron. There's another tetrahydron. It's out there, folks. We got it, NASA. You don't have to tell us where it's at. We can see it. And then there's Nibiru up in the very, very corner, folks. That's Nibiru up there. Just below the time and date stamp. And we'll end up letting you know where you can watch this online. And if they take it down, it's a shame, folks. It'd be stupid to take it down. It's element. She ain't gonna hurt us, folks. It's just in the comet flashing by. The beer was pretty big, though. They're gonna have to wake up and tell about that. So, news flash. Thanks, Honey Bear. And I'm not gonna give you a number out, but you know what your number is. So, I'm trying to zoom in on the tetrahydrons, folks. So there it is. It's a mountain camera, folks. 21st of September, folks. I want to say hi to my kids, Bug and Junior. Love you both. And thanks, Sugar Bear, for this beautiful, beautiful camera shot. 
And we've got all this frozen here, folks. Frozen to show you that it's the truth. And the movie will play. And it is real, folks. I'll keep it on Ellen. And see if I can... Matter of fact, there's two tetrahydrons on the lower part of the screen, folks. I'm at 200%. There's two of the tetrahydrons down. It's not, not, repeat, that's tetrahydrons. It's not solar flare from the sun. It's not solar flare from the sun, folks. That's a tetrahydrons. Okay? I'm seeing a block side of them. Everybody will get to study these pictures. Pretty awesome. I'm going to try to save this to movie for player tonight. Probably even before I even put it on, post it on the net. There's that one, folks. I keep angling it this way, it works a little better. It almost looks like the Chrysler emblem, folks, on the Chrysler cars from years ago. So, it's been knowledgeable for years and years and years, folks. I'm trying to angle in on that. There's that one that kind of highlights pretty glowy. But no matter what, folks, that's Nibiru up there. In the right-hand corner by the time frame. Okay, we're moving into 11 minutes here. I'm going to hit and try to see if I can play the video, folks. And there's a real big tetrahydron over here to the right. Okay. And I'm zooming back out. To show you the whole mountain range and everything like that. It's a real government camera and everything, folks. Sharing for education here, folks. It, everything's cool and it's just a gauntlet. Okay, we'll hit play. I'm not sure if I'm playing it right, so... I'm going to hit the movie, and I think it'll play it, folks. Matter of fact, here you can see the tetrahydrons coming in early. Look, at you can see the stars. Or either that or this was later in the evening. This is showing 6.08 p.m. on that. I think it's p.m. It could be a.m. Go back up to the clock for a second. Yep, it's AM, folks. This is AM. So they're catching it in the morning. Okay. I'm sure somebody can look up government appeal and figure that out, but it'd be better to keep it all hushed, folks. I want to keep this hushed so everybody can keep on seeing it. 6 AM, so I'll try to catch it tomorrow, too, folks. Wednesday, September.